another vlog and another unboxing. I received, I received some packages. I don't know why the camera is so high. I will fix it. I received some packages from Nash and Namshi, and we're gonna do an unboxing together. And I'll explain to you why there's so many boxes coming to my. Get my unboxing chair and let's let it do what it do. Cues unboxing music. Oh wait, before the unboxing music. So the reason I have so many packages and they're more on the way, I went overboard a tinge bit, just a, a speck, a tinge with this Black Friday, White Friday, whatever you call it, sale. You no, know, I saw some things that were 50%, 70%. So I did, okay? And that's the reason. Do I regret it? Not yet. Hopefully I don't. So let us see what happened. Okay, first of all, don't like this material, but okay. of how I made that happen. Let me wash my hands. Especially a particular supermarket. I always go for a healthy aisle and there's always something I'm like, mm, maybe it's nice. So I bought this thing called proper proper chips. And I bought also the paleo, paleo, paleo puffs. And I bought um a ginger beer. I tried the ginger beer and it is busting. Like the ginger beer tastes very good. The only concern I have regarding the ginger beer is that it could be oh god. It could be a little bit more um, carbonated, you know, I feel like a gas, but I feel like a gas. But it's called Bundaberg from Australia. Come on, hold on, let me show you. It's Bundaberg from Australia, and it is the closest thing to the Jamaican ginger beer that I have found. Love, 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 love. I'm so happy I found it. So yeah, let's do a taste test and see if it's that great or not. All right, so first we're going to do the Paleo Puffs. Actually... Right, yeah, from the look of it, it's a no for me. Immediate no. Immediately from the okay, if I'm judging the book by its cover, immediately no. So look, like yo, what is this? No, and it's cheese. No cheese, cheesiness. Yo, guys. When am I gonna just stay in my lane and just know this organic thing is just not for me? <sighs> okay, let's try. Mm. 
it has the crunch but it doesn't have the cheesiness like it's not bad but it tastes like cardboard yeah it tastes like cardboard mm -mm. i mean i'm still gonna eat it with this. <laughs> it wasn't cheap but it's not great so this is like a three three out of ten mm -mm. What does paleo even mean anyways? What's paleo mean? No gluten. GMO, non-GMO. With organic coconut oil. Wait. Actually, the aftertaste now tastes cheesy. Maybe I judged it too early. Okay, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. tastes like actually i think the more you eat is a better it gets is that is that weird have cheese it tastes cheesy now and salty anyways yeah okay five out of ten not bad yeah a little asmr action hold on the people that love asmr i am going to tell you Okay, now proper chips. These are made of lentil. You can see here. Lentil chips. Come on, focus. Let's see how great it is. Eat so eat proper. Hey, as a proper girl. As a proper girl. Mmm. Yeah. <laughs> yes. This one. Yeah, no, this one, this one. This one valid. Mm -hmm. Proper chips, proper. Valid. Eight out of ten. This don't even taste healthy. That's the thing. Great taste. It is a great taste. I ain't gonna hold you. Wait. We'll buy more of this. Carbon net zero. What I say? Climate change. Boom. Got me saving the environment. One chips at a time. Give it a little ASMR action again. That's it. Then, what else can I try? What else would I like? you? Hold on. But this is the US one is an expiry date, first of all. Because it's been like over a month. So it's called Lenny and Larry's The Complete Cookie Plant Based. Alright, so we're going to try this. We're going to try this cookie. Okay. It don't look great, but so it looks like this. So we're gonna and I had this piece. So we're gonna try this piece and see. I remember the last time I didn't really like it, but let's see. Maybe I'm in a giving mood tonight. Hold on. It's tough, bro. Hold on. It doesn't taste terrible. But it doesn't taste great. Like if you're really dedicated to health and you, you want plant-based things, like if you're a vegan for real, this kosher too, if you're Jewish too and it's something there, and you want to try these things, then, no, it's not for vegan people, sorry, it has milk. So if you're plant-based, like if you're a vegetarian and such things, I'll give it a six, a six pound, six, six out of ten. What should I call this section? To Cam's honest review. No. Cam's cravings. You see Cam cravings. Cam's cravings. Healthy edition. I don't know. But yeah. Anyway. Okay. The first taste don't taste good. You have to eat this enough time for it to hit, you know? See you guys. ASMR for your head top. Alright. Oh, yeah, man. 
ginger beer not bad if there's one thing that will happen there will be traffic on UAE National Day and I just don't know when it will stop and people will learn to just walk because most places are within walking distance to be honest with you but hey keeping you updated on the ones and twos as to what is happening in the city <laughs> Zanzibar. After Zanzibar, I said we're gonna be in Abu Dhabi for a while. Well, change of plans. I want you guys to guess. Nobody will guess where I'm going. Well, except for my mother. Mommy, you can't come in. But we're going somewhere not so far away. I have a conundrum. So I'm going away for over a month and I quite literally do not know what to take with me. I do not know what to pack. to do as a plant parent is I need to get all my plants at the front of my door so that tomorrow I remember to take them to work so that my co-worker can take care of them for me until I come back priority So that's a wrap for tonight i'll see you guys when i see i still have to finish packing obviously um but yeah i think i did enough for tonight so we're gonna get some rest we have work early in the morning we gotta transport these babies to the office i'll see you when i see you peace bro one of my plans fully i are gonna put you at the bottom of the the social ladder.
Can you fit? So you're here. Beautiful. And you go in the back. Y'all, if you know what happened to me right now. So one of the plans, which I couldn't capture because like the entire basement, what I feel, was looking at me completely bewildered by my behavior. The plan fell from the bag I was taking it in, straight to the ground. All of the soil is out of the, the pot. My plant is one place, my pot is one place, everyone. <laughs> so I quickly said, it happens, it happens. So I couldn't vlog it, but that happened. And it was with my peace lily. And if you know my peace lily, she is very temperamental. And so, yeah, I learned a lesson this morning, which is do not put a heavy plant in a paper bag. You know, common sense wasn't common sense. -y. So that is happening and because of that i'm strapped for time to go to work and of course i am catching can you see oh it's gone yeah anyways i wanted to show you guys but no i can't because the green light i am catching all the red lights here i can't make this up every time you're late for something all the red lights and when i have nowhere to go green 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 verde verde green listen <laughs> Also have a staff party happening next week tell me if you guys want to see tell me if you guys want to see all that jazz because sometimes I'm like mm, my life is so routine what, like, what, what else could you want to see right but I'll never know bro what's is there an accident eh? like why is this lady not moving red light Red light district, fully lit. Well, not lit yet. This is some radio. Bro, go! I was a Land Cruiser trying to be a Range Rover on the road. What am I doing? What am I doing? Yeah, we can switch that lane now. What okay? What is the point of you, sir, coming in the lane and then indicating after the fact? It's called an indicator, right? You indicate where you are going before you go there, not while you're going there, not after you've gone there. Yeah, I need to fill my tank too. Wow, I didn't realize I was on eight. Y'all, I see you when I see you because I'm not having the time of my life right now. I'm not. Okay. We dropped the goods. Now, it's time for us okay, to go, baby. For us to go. Hey, am I gonna do it? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Yes, I can. It's a tinge bit tight, but we made it. Oh, it's hot too. And plus, of all, I am in this sweater in the sun. The thing is, when I dress like this, it's usually because. I don't have to go I don't have to go to um I mean I don't have to go outside but I did not foresee it and think I why do you not think so far ahead lighting gets poor it's time for me to go and chase that bag you all have an amazing day and I will see you back at home hopefully I guess we're gonna do that parking at one time and I'm moving nothing. One, oh Jesus. Nah, I'm gonna do one time me a park. One time. I don't care what you have to say, I'm gonna go back. 
one time. Hey, I wanna know about driving. Fun fact, when I first started driving, if you can remember, I was so afraid to do the reverse park. But now I'm more afraid to do the front parking. You know, life, you just never know. You just never know what's gonna happen because if someone said, come away, you're gonna, you're gonna be reverse parking in every situation. I'll be no, never. But now I'm a reverse parking girly. 